Rocks Fishing, and I'm Mike D. Well, the other day, I was out summer, and I caught this beautiful AJ. I'm sure some of you have already seen the video of the AJs and Sharks video. I'll put the link up here somewhere or in the description for that video. But uh, we caught that AJ, and I also did a How to Clean an AJ video. I'll also put that link in the description or up here somewhere if I can figure out how to do it. And uh, well, today, we're going to catch cook that AJ. We're going to do it on the grill. We're going to do it Caribbean jerk style. So today we're doing a catch and cook. So real quick you guys, check out this footage of me catching that AJ out there with Summer 11 miles offshore. And I'll see you at the cleaning table, then I'll see you at the grill. I gain a little bit. He takes twice as much as I gained. It's got to be a shark. On my luck, it's going to be a big sandbar shark. Can't take those. I would have had to hook him on this rod instead of my big rod. Come on, just let me see you, buddy. Let me see you. Just let me see you. Pretty sure it ain't no barracuda. Not taking this long. Oh, it's a big old AJ. We get to keep him. We get to keep him. Yeah, we get to keep him, honey. Oh, look at yeah, watch yourself, watch yourself. Watch yourself. There's a barracuda and Yeah. What? We get to take him. Oh. Oh, Lord. Choke off. Holy cow. Man. I was not expecting that. Just took off. Reef donkey. Yep. Hold on, baby. That's a big AJ, too, buddy. He is not letting up. He is not letting up. Come on. Warn him, but if I lose him, I lose him. I need to get his ass out. House of Pain. Come on, baby. That is a big old stud. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. He is not letting me have anything. And I am putting some major heat to him. Major heat to him. He must be good. Yeah, but keep messing around with him too much longer I'm gonna lose him get that pull, get that out of the way oh Jesus I'm breathing heavy Come on, Bubba. Come on. Big old AJ, man. Come on, baby. Come on, just come on. Oh, come on. Big. See that gap, baby. Oh. 
got him. I got slack. Holy crap. Oh my god. That is a big OAG. Holy moly. Well, y'all, there's a reef donkey. Big old AJ. All right, guys, I got my big AJ here. And I apologize, next door. They're working their tails off over there, making all kinds of noise. So we're gonna clean this AJ real quick. All right, guys, quick. I got my pile of AJ meat here. It's getting real dark, it's getting ready to rain, so I got this done just in time. I'm gonna take the rest of this in the house and before I freeze it, I'll clean up some of this bloodline here. And uh, any bones that I left in there, like I left a couple right there, we'll get those out. And we'll put them in a Ziploc baggie, a little quart size baggie with some water and freeze them. And this will last me a while. This All is right, guys, fish. we're at the grill. Got my grill going. It's nice and hot. So now here I got my nice AJ steaks. Man, those things look awesome. I've already cut all the bloodline out of it. So all that's taken care of. There's no bones. They're perfectly boneless. They're really nice little steaks. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take some Caribbean jerk marinade. And I'm going to coat my AJ steaks here and put them on the grill. So I got one. Put them all in there real good. So I got one nice coated there. Put it on the grill. Another one going. I mean, I'm telling you guys right now, you cannot go wrong with grilling some AJ. It is excellent. But I'm gonna get the rest of these coated, put on the grill. I'll be back with you in a minute. All right, guys, I got all my AJ steaks on. Now I'm gonna let them cook on one side for about six to eight minutes, between 300 and 400 degrees. Then I'll flip them over another six to eight All minutes. Right guys, we're gonna check them real quick. Oh man, they are looking good. Oh, they didn't stick very well. That's awesome. They didn't stick at all, actually. A little bit there. I don't like it when they stick. Get that one off. All right. Man, they're looking awesome. I cleaned my basting brush because you don't want to use the same brush that you used with a raw fish to baste your steaks here. So make sure you clean that brush. All right, man, these are looking outstanding, y'all. You guys got to try this out with some AJ. If you catch AJs and you've never really kept them, Give this a shot, y'all. All right, we'll let these cook a little bit. We'll get back to you guys. Let's check on them real quick. Holy moly, that looks awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and baste them again. I'm gonna let them cook for a little bit longer and then I'll flip them over again. All right, guys, they should be about done. Oh boy, look at that. All righty, we'll take these off real quick. So it's falling apart, it's so done. Awesome. Man, this stuff looks good. Pulling apart on me. Got it. And this one right here. And this piece right here is for my boy Jared at work. That one's for you, brother. I really appreciate your support, man. Alright, guys. I'll turn this off. Turn all that off. And we're gonna put a little bit of this sauce right here on top of them, just a little bit. So 
just like that. Just drizzle it on top. I'll give Jared some. All right, guys. This is what we end up with. And I'll tell you, that looks and smells absolutely delicious. Can't wait hey to guys, eat. guys, I got my uh, AJ all done here. Got some vegetables and some rice with it. So we're gonna go ahead and try this real quick. Holy moly. Man, that was good. Wow. That is outstanding. I mean, that is incredible. If you've never tried AJ on the grill, you need to give it a shot. It's excellent. I also like it baked and I also like it fried. And it makes really good smoked fish dip. AJ is a really good fish, y'all. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And I appreciate you guys for watching. And I also want to say big thank you to all you people out there that have subscribed to my channel and showed me support. I appreciate you guys very, very much. Truly, I do. Well, guys, I get to see you again soon here on the water. Tie lines, y'all. Thank you.